Dog House or welcome back to the Dog House. My name is Jessica. If you are new here, welcome. And you might not know this, but sometimes I get to do some really cool product reviews. A lot of, basically they're all geared towards pet ownership. So I've got something here that is something I've always wanted to have or get. And it is something very useful for the dog house. Hopefully, this is obviously a review. I don't know this product. I don't know if anybody else has really had this product. I think it's newer. I don't exactly know when it came out, but I can tell you a little bit more about it in a second. I'm gonna show it to you guys because the reason why I'm really excited about this is because there's a lot of people that have commented over the last, I guess, year or so since I've been on the YouTube with the dogs. They've asked about how do I keep the house appearing to seem so clean when I have so many pets. I do have six dogs currently living in this house. Sometimes I'll have more, sometimes I'll have less. Anyways, um, and a few cats that are in and out. So there is a lot of tidying up to do on a daily basis. There is no secret to keeping the house, your house clean with pets. If there is one and you know it, let me know or I'm still looking, I don't know. Uh, it's a lot of movie magic as far as like, what's what I call it on my channel. Like when I, when somebody does ask like, how do you keep it so clean? Well, I mean, it's daily routine. You know, you just, you, you have to vacuum. And here's the, here's the kicker. It's not as clean as it appears. Yes, it's clean. It's not a disgusting house like a lot of people have actually also assumed I've seen, uh, but it's, I mean, shed happens all right so yes I have shedding dogs and they do shed and it's bad so I have to keep up with it and if I don't keep up with it there's gonna be the tumbleweeds throughout the house and the corners that collect I have very big white tile so it's it's no secret when you actually look down at it uh, so yeah I just kind of keep up with it as much as I can it's not fu the funnest thing but it's you do what you gotta do if you don't want to deal with that that's, you know, didn't, don't have six dogs and four cats in your house, <laughs> whatever. So anyways, today I got Font Vacuum Robot M500 is what it's called. So we're gonna go ahead and open it here. I have not tried it yet. This is the first, uh, I have peeked at it and kind of taken it out of like the plastic stuff that was all up in there to make it a little bit easier and less obnoxious of a video. There is a lot of products out there that are very similar to a Roomba, this is just one of them. So, and I was lucky enough to have uh, the creators of LeFant, LeFant send me one for free. This is on Amazon. There will be a link in the description box below. Uh, if you guys wanted to check it out, check out the reviews there. I actually haven't looked at the reviews. I'm just gonna wing it for myself. So it's basically a, yeah, a smart or robot vacuum that vacuums your house by itself. Like, you know, so I'm pretty sure some people are familiar. So it comes with a couple of different things here. Uh, I heard, I actually noticed that it does have a mopping method. So it not only vacuums, but mops as well. So I'm sure it's not like your full on mop, obviously. This is the part for the mopping, like you trade it out, I guess. We'll just have to see. Um, and so yeah, and there you can put like a little obviously liquid in there and it like spot cleans as it goes the whole time. All right, so what's kind of cool that I don't know if the, I'm assuming some of them do, but this one does have a Wi-Fi wi connectivity. There's actually an app you put on your phone for it that you could, that helps you control it, I guess. And it, I guess it sends you like, I'll have to look into that. I don't have the app on my phone just yet because I'm literally just opening this up. Um, it's self-charging, it's supposed to, put itself back on the charger when it needs be, which I find super interesting. <laughs> uh, and for 250 bucks, it's pretty, it's a little creepy, but also a little, um, it's pretty cool. So that works for me. So I will have to find an area to put the charging dock. So there is a charging station. I don't have a cord to plug into the wall and I'll have to figure out where to put that safely. All right, so also it apparently adapts to surfaces. So if you have like a rug and it's on top a tile and then you have the linoleum or whatever is on the floor, like I, that's what I kind of think about. I'm like, how is that gonna work? Uh, apparently it doesn't matter if it's in the vacuum mode, I think, is where it will, it'll actually get up on the carpet and be fine and go back and transition back to tile like immediately and do, do its job. So uh, we'll be testing that out. Probably not actually today, cause funny enough right now when I'm gonna pull it out, I don't have any of my rugs down. 
So anyways, we're just gonna try it on the tile today. So one of the functions that I uh, was told that it has is a free movement or free move. So basically, I think that what it means by that is like it actually has, like I think these are like, like a, not a camera, I don't know what to call it. I'm not, you know, I'm not a scientist or, you know, a technician, but, or a mechanic. But anyways, I think it, it can unstuck itself. Like, it won't get stuck. It actually, it actually senses when it's going to come into contact with something, like a cord that's laying on the ground or something, I guess, or a furniture leg or anything like that. And it can actually avoid getting stuck. And even if it does get stuck, it can actually, it supposedly can remove itself. It does, it comes with four of these little doohickeys. I guess the sweepy motion, because there's only two spots for it. Again, I literally have not messed with this since we've got it, since right now. Um, so those clip on right there. Sorry, it's a little dark background. Do my face, that's very white. Uh, and then we have this is like the front, I'm assuming the front wheel where it's gonna, or I, maybe that's the back, I don't freaking know. Well, back is here, so there you go. Here's the wheels. I actually know also when it's in mop mode, when you switch out, so this here, we're not gonna use it for this video, but this is like, I think the part that holds the stuff, the debris. Yeah, so it vacuums up. But when it's in mop mode, you put the other, you switch it for the little chamois there. And it comes with an extra one as well. It goes in there. Yeah, you add the liquid in there. But we're gonna use the vacuum mode and it does have a filter inside and it actually comes with an extra filter for when you need it. All right, so I guess we're gonna get started. But first, let me show you the, re the horrible reality of Jessica's house when I haven't vacuumed in an hour. Just kidding, it's been like a day. It actually claims to be ideal for pet hair. So uh, challenge accepted, welcome to the dog house. We'll see. And also, obviously, one of the biggest questions I have, and I feel like at this point you guys are gonna have the same one, is how is this going to work running around free in my house with six dogs that like to tear things up like this. <laughs> I'm not sure, I'm, I'm curious to see if it's Dexter proof or Grim proof. I don't, I don't know what's gonna happen, so we'll see. All right, let's go take a look. All right, so I set it up here in our hallway, just kind of out of the way. Of course, dogs are <laughs> a little curious, especially you and you, Zuko. So, I did find the instructions that I took out before, because I'm a dumb dumb. But anyways, I figured it out, but I did read that it wants it to charge for like 12 hours at first before using it. That's right, it's 2019. And I'm not gonna sit here and be like, oh, only charge for like 30 minutes and then clean my, uh-oh. This is no shit. He thinks because I'm talking to the camera, it's time to like. Uh oh, oh my god, it just started. Wait! I didn't want the dogs out for this! Oh! Oh my gosh! Hold up! Oh my god, it just. Same! Same! Uh, alright, so just put itself back on the charger because it's not. Ch Dexter! Okay, well, uh, so anyways, um, I'm going to let it charge and get these hooligans away from it. Oh my, this is so weird. And probably, it's very scary for the new robot. Hey, leave the robot alone. Harvey's been crying. You me? What the heck? It's you and Gunner that are the worst. And funny enough, Gunner's actually worse than you, Crib. <laughs> Uh, okay, so I'm gonna let it charge. Oh, Dexter, you keep activating it. I don't understand. Go back. Go back to your charging station. Lafayette. I'm gonna name it Lafayette. Dexter. Good job. Look, I can train robots too, not just your stupid dogs. Dexter. All right, I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna put these hooligans away, and I'm gonna test it out. Uh, in about 30 minutes, but we're just doing a test run. We're not gonna have it charged for 30 minutes and then I'm gonna have it shut up, do its own, do the whole house. So we're just gonna see what it does. Okay, all right, so I have timed it and we did a little bit over 30 minutes of charging, chucking it, really? No. So I think 
Jackie, you want to <coughs> want to do the honors? Do you have any idea what you're doing? <coughs> Yay! Oh, Jackie! Cheesy boy here. Ready? <coughs> Tap. <laughs> so. Go play. Um, I guess let's go. We're gonna see how it does. Of course, Dexter is gonna be lit. No, no. All right, so blue that hair. It's interesting. Um, I guess it's vacuuming here. Got a lot of stuff for you to do. Okay, I see it back. Oh, all right. Okay. Where are you going? All right, so I have timed it, and we did a little bit over 30 minutes of charging. Chucky, really? No. So I think, Jackie, you want to want to do the honors? Do you have any idea what you're doing? Yay! Oh, Jackie, cheesy boy here. Ready? Tap. <laughs> so. Um, I guess let's go. We're gonna see how it does. Of course, Dexter is gonna be lit. No, no. All right, so blue that hair. It's interesting. Um, I guess it's vacuuming here. Got a lot of stuff for you to do. Okay, I see it back. Oh, all right. Okay. Where are you going? It's off. Uh-oh. Chucky, what do you think? I mean, I guess, uh, again, I, I haven't mopped. Like, I didn't do the floors, obviously. This is a, okay, it's on a cord. Moving the light around. Uh oh. Here's a test. That was pretty cool. I mean, it missed that hair, and now it's under the couch. Chucky, what do you think? Rim. Hello? Oh, hi. Alrighty. Oh, hi. Alrighty. You like this spot? Oh, okay. Go up. <laughs> oh, okay. Are you gonna go anywhere else? Uh oh, did you get stuck? You're supposed to get yourself unstuck. What is that? It's officially stuck. But I don't think I was supposed to get the cord out. Are you gonna figure it out? Can you get unstuck? Chucky, help. Chucky's got it. <laughs> okay, let's help. I'll help you, Lafayette. That's okay. There we go. That wasn't too bad. Let me get rid of this. Stop trying to go up this light. I would really like it to go over there. And like maybe back over here. It's kind of vacuuming. So a big thing that I am worried about is like, yeah, your average person probably doesn't have six dogs, but I've seen, you know, <laughs> I don't know if this is helping or not, Jackie. I've seen people with like one dog and have issue with hair everywhere, but like, does it get, is it gonna get too full here? Obviously, I wouldn't just like 100% rely on this to do my floors all the time now. It would just be helpful, I guess, in between if it survives these dogs. Oh, Chucky. Oh, you know what's probably happening? It's Chucky, you're steering it by getting in the way. Thinks you're an object. Or maybe are you hurting it? Chucky, let it come this way. Oh, it's coming over here, yeah. Work your magic. Chucky, don't get involved. 
Do not. Here, let it get, let it get, whoa! There we go. Let it go over there. Stop it. I just like turned away from the clump. That wasn't very, took some of it. Don't turn away from the club. Oh, it's coming over here, yeah. Work your magic. Chucky, don't get involved. Just... I'm not. Here, let it get, let it get. Woo! There we go. Let it go over there. Stop it. I just like turned away from the clump. That wasn't very took some of it. Don't turn away from the club. Chucky. Cheese. <laughs> Something wrong with you, cat. So I guess those little brushes are like the fingers to get it. <laughs> Chucky, what'd you do? Hello? Again, actually, yeah, I didn't charge it all the way, so I don't know if that was part of that. I don't know. What did you do? Meet Lafayette. Is there any cleaner? She? You know. Kisa, what's that? Do you care? Okay. Is it the kitten video all over again? Are you gonna go down the hall and get what you missed? Thanks. Oh, okay. If you need a charge, go and find your station. Hello? If you're tired, yeah, get that clump. No! Come on, Lila, what do you think? What does Lila think? Oh. Yeah, get that clump. Yes. Good boy! <laughs> that we use while dogs are out. <laughs> Zuko. Um, yes, I could definitely teach them in the future to leave it alone. We're just seeing how they react to it right now, but I will be working on that. Uh, it wouldn't be that hard actually at all. So. Why are you yelping at it? Grimmy. Um, I'm glad it comes with extra little brushies. <laughs> Grimmy does not like it. Oh, oh no. Grim. He's cleaning. He's trying to clean up. Grandma. Dexter. So, yep, you guys are just going to bully it. Oh, wow. Okay. So, um, let's review. All right, guys, that's going to end this video with the Lafant vacuum, robot vacuum. Um, it's back on the charger. I don't know whether or not it's going to hold up around all these dogs, but we're going to see how it goes and if it kind of helps with the in-between cleanings and not waking up to an actual whole hurricane of dog hair every morning after just doing the floors all the time. So 
I don't know, if you guys are interested in looking and checking into one, there obviously is going to be a link in the description below, like I said earlier, and that's it. Uh, I'm actually super excited to give it a try when we're like not home and the dogs are put away. So yeah, I don't know if it's gonna survive Chucky harassing it the whole time though, so we'll see. Say bye, say bye Zuko. Say bye to Zuko. You're just gonna sleep? What are you doing? Act. Act. No? Go! Wow, okay. Oh, there's that. Way to make me look like a fool. Thumbnail. So, there's that. Okay, hmm. <clears throat> so review. Let's re There's nothing in there. <laughs> Is it supposed to go there? Where'd everything I mean there's dust. <sighs> Alright, well, um thanks for watching and uh thanks LaFont for letting me have this for free. Bye!